Hi, good morning. I'm Christine. I'm your guest for today. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Um, do you have a preferred name to call to? Yeah, you can call me William. Right, hi, William. William, I'm here to check your blood glucose um, level, your, your reading, blood glucose reading. Um, is that okay with you? Yeah, okay. Okay, but before that, we are going to check your identity, your details in your wristband that match with my patient chart. Is that all right? Yes. Okay. Um, can you please state your complete name? Yeah, I'm William Richard. That's good. It matches. Okay, your date of birth, please. 7 September 1982. And your address? 11 Vatican County. That's perfect. And your MRN or your hospital number is called 50583. And that is match with your risk line. Okay, now I'm in the right patient. Oh, by the way, do you have any allergies to food or medication? No. All right, okay, let me see. Yes, you are not allergic to anything. So, um, William, when I get your blood test, I mean the blood glucose test reading, I need to get the blood from the edge of your fingertips. Is that all right? Uh, yes. Okay, now, William, here's the cobalt. If you need anything, I will prepare all the equipments that we need to do the reading of your glucose, and then I'll be back shortly. Is that all right? Okay. Okay, then. Hi, William. I'm back. Are you okay? Yes. Okay, sorry for waiting. And um, before we start the procedure, um, I need to make sure if you wash your hands. Yes, I do. Yeah. To be, we need to make it sure that your hands are clean and dry before we start the procedure. And um, by the way, did you recognize what time did you eat your last intake of food and fluid? I think it's two hours, be two hours before this perfect. Okay, now we're going to start now the procedure. Is that okay with you? Yes. Okay, let me see and check your fingertips to yeah. make it sure there is no inflammation or rashes or anything in there. That's perfectly fine. Now, before we start the, the, the pricking, we need to make it sure the fingertips that you are going to use. So, only the three fingers, index, ring finger, and the middle, you are going to use, except the pointer finger and then the thumb, okay? Now, I'm going to start now. Inserting the strips to the glucometer, just get it ready, but do not push it forward. Okay, William, you ready? I'm going to use the ring finger edge. So, you have to prick, you have to press, and then make sure you prick on the side of the fingertips. Here we go. Okay. And then, just the time, you can let it go. Insert the strips further more and then press. Get the blood, make it sure we need to and get the blood. It should cover the edge of the strips and then you will get the bleeding. Then, Straight away the shot going to the beam. And also your lens, your single use lens that you have to remove it accordingly and then in the shot. That's it. And then you have to apply the gauze if you observe that there is a bleeding in there. Are you okay, William? Yes. All right, okay, thank you for that. Then afterwards you have to remove all of the apron. Then you have to dispose it accordingly. That's it, William. We're done with the glucose test reading. And uh, by the way, you okay? Yeah. Okay. Uh, William, your result is 4.5 mmol, which is a normal level. So I will document it in your file, and then if it's necessary, like if it's going to be high after two hours, I will check on you, and then we can escalate it to your GB. And if you have more concerns, please let me know, okay? Okay. Thank you for your cooperation, um, William. And then I will give you your call calls. If you need anything, please ring me that now, okay? Okay, thank you. All the 
for scissors, you have to remember that you need to, to do the five afters. So first is you have to fix the patient. The second one is you have to offer the cobbles or nurse bell. The third one is you do the infection control, which is you do the hand washing or hand hygiene. This is using the WHO guidelines. And then the fourth one is you do the documentation accordingly, according to New Zealand guidelines as well. And then the last one is you do escalate as necessary. Thank you for watching.